the first thing is to diagnose why they're getting it, and that usually means an MRI. And the MRI scanners are fantastic because they really show us the spine. It's like opening the bonnet of a car and, and seeing what's going on. And that really gives you the diagnosis, although clinically we can suspect it from the sort of way the pain is going and the fact that the patient, if you lift their leg up and the nerves tight, it shoots off down the leg because there's the nerves being stretched over the bit of disc. And then once you've got the diagnosis, you've got to decide what you're going to do about it. Most of the time it's rest and painkillers, sometimes quite strong painkillers. But if that doesn't help, then you may be a little bit of physiotherapy, but in the early stages that will make it worse often because you're just irritating the nerve more trying to move. And it's often just rest and painkillers. And nature luckily heals itself most of the time. 